thou proud Demetrius? Speak thou now! Heal, villain! Where are they? Worn and ready! I will be straight with thee! Follow me then! Straight around! Lysander, speak again! Art thou fled? Where dost thou hide thy face? Coward! Are thou bragging to the stars? Tell in the bushes that thou lookest for war. And will not come, come from wrecking, come thou child. I'll whip thee with a rod, he is the foe. That draws a sword on thee. Art thou there? Follow thy voice, for we'll try no man would hear. He goes before me, and still dares me on. When I come where he calls, then he is gone. The villain is much lighter heel than I. I followed fast, but faster he did fly. And here am I in dark and even way. Here will rest me, come thou gentle day. But if but once thou show me thy grey light, I'll find Demetrius and revenge this spite. Now here on this cold bed will I rest my head. <sighs> tedious night. Abate thy hour, shines comforts from the east that I may back to Athens by daylight, and sleep that sometimes shuts up sorrow's eye. Steal me a while from mine own company. But can't you wonder at this show? But wander on, till truth makes all things plain. This man is Pyramus, if you would know. This beauteous lady, Thisbe is certain. This man with lime and rough casts of present wall, <laughs> that vile wall, which did these lovers sunder. And three walls chink, poor souls. And three walls chink, poor souls, they are content to whisper, at the which let no man wonder. This man with lanthorn dog and bush of thorns presenteth moonshine, for if you will know, by moonshine did this lover sink no scorn, to meet at Nancy's tomb, there, there to woo. This grisly beast, which lion hide by name, roar, 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 roar. The trusty Thisbe, coming first by night, did scare away, or rather did a fright, and as she fled her mantle she did fall, which lion vile and bloody mouth did stain. <laughs> and on comes Pyramus, sweet tooth and tall, and finds his trusty Thisbe's mantle slain. Whereat, with blade, with bloody, blameful blade, he bravely broached his bloody, boiling breast. And Thisbe, tarrying in mulberry shade, his dagger drew and died. <laughs> For all the rest, let lion, moonshine, wall, and lovers twain at last to course, while here they do remain.